As one of the most sought after body types in all of the modern world, an hourglass body shape can be recognized from celebrities such as Kim Kardashian, Beyonce, Sofia Vergara. But it's also equally important knowing how to dress it. So stay tuned because I'm going to teach you all the tips and tricks you need to better dress this body type. Hey guys, it's Bella. Welcome back to my channel, Concept3, where I help you level up your wardrobe, yourself, and your lifestyle. Today's video is going to be the second one I do on my body shape series, which is a series in which I talk about how to dress each of the five body shapes. Today I will be talking about how to dress an hourglass body shape and give you guys some tips and tricks that will help you easily dress your body and make you have a balanced silhouette. You might be this body shape if you have slightly round shoulders, bust and hips of the same width, a small defined waist, rounded hips and bottom, and if you tend to gain weight evenly throughout your body. The goal of this body type is to emphasize that small waist while at the same time still balancing out the shoulders and hips and making sure that those proportions look equally balanced. First, we're going to start with what type of necklines really make this body shape look amazing. The general rule with tops and necklines in specific is you don't want to wear a neckline that is going to unbalance the natural silhouette of the body. You want to avoid tops that are going to broaden your shoulders and make your shoulders look too wide and also tops that are going to add bulkiness and volume to the top half of your body. Some styles you really want to avoid are wide necklines and high necklines that are narrow that have embellishments around this area. And you want to avoid these styles because basically a high narrow neckline is going to make you look very narrow up here and it's going to unbalance the symmetry of your body and if you wear very wide necklines it's going to make your shoulders look a lot broader and again unbalance you know the natural silhouette of your of your of your body some do's are oval necklines some some great necklines you can wear are off the shoulder sweetheart square scoop or v-neck. <laughs> All of these are some really great options that will make you look beautiful and that are really going to balance out the upper portion of your body without making it look too wide or too narrow in proportion to your hips. Next we're going to talk all about sleeves. So just as with the neckline, the goal with sleeves is to not unbalance the natural silhouette of the body. So you want to look for sleeves that don't visually add width to the top of your shoulders or that don't add unnecessary volume as well. Absolutely avoid sleeves with large embellishments and sleeves that are just too wide and too puffy. Anything that basically will draw a lot of unnecessary attention to the upper body. And if you do opt for like slightly shoulder enhancing sleeves, make sure you balance it out by adding bottoms that give you a little bit more volume so you're still maintaining a balanced look. This being said, the best type of sleeve would be a fitted sleeve. This is going to show people the natural size of your shoulders without making them look too wide or without making them look too narrow. Some examples of sleeves that look great on an hourglass are sleeveless, satin, three-fourth, fitted, and bishop sleeves. These are definitely some tips to follow if you want to have a nice, have a nice balanced silhouette. The goal with tops is to accentuate your small waist while at the same time balancing out the width of your shoulders and your hips. So with tops you're going to want to wear something that really emphasizes your waist and something that also doesn't add too much bulk to your shoulder. Tops should definitely be fitted. They should nip at the waist without adding unnecessary volume to the midsection. And you're also going to want to choose tops that extend to about the top of your hip bone. You're going to want to avoid tops that have a lot of ruffles, big bows, a lot of unnecessary embellishments on the shoulder. This is one area you're not going to want to emphasize. You're going to want to emphasize your waist and show off just how small it is. Those were the don'ts. Some of the do's are fitted tops. As an hourglass figure, Fitted tops are your best friend because your ba your body is already pretty balanced with your bust and your hips being more or less the same width and being balanced and your smaller waist, so you're going to want to wear fitted tops. Some options include a fitted t-shirt, a fitted wrap top, a belted top, or even a peplum top. 
With this body type, you can get away with a lot of tops. I mean, you're not limited to just these few that I named, but these are generally going to be your best option. And yeah, so for tops, that's about it. I think that tops are pretty easy with this body type. You just don't want to do anything extra, no fluffy things on the sleeve, no embellishments up there. You just want to keep it simple, classic, and elegant. <laughs> Lastly, we're going to talk about everyone's favorite part of dressing, which is dresses, or at least it's my favorite part. So like with the tops, when choosing dresses, this body type really has to focus on drawing attention to the waist and emphasizing the waist. Because that's, you know, with this body type, that's your weapon. A tiny, tiny waist. At the same time, not adding too much volume to the bust or to the shoulders. Some of the don'ts for dresses in this body type are wearing really boxy and unfitted dresses. And this is really unflattering on this body type because you have such a small waist. So if you're wearing a straight boxy dress, you're going to lose your waist in the dress and it's going to make you look even bigger in the midsection. So this being said, nipped and belted dresses are going to be your best friend because these emphasize your already small waist and make it look even smaller and it just draws attention to the perfect place on your body. Some dress types that are great for this body are a wrap dress, a shift dress, a paneled waist dress, a bias dress, and a peplum dress. So with all these dresses, they really, really flatter your figure. To summarize what we talked about for this body shape, you really want to make sure you emphasize your small waist while at the same time balancing out the shoulders and the hips to make sure you have a balanced silhouette. You want to make sure you follow these tips so that you are dressing your body to the best of your ability. This being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys now have a better idea on how to dress your body shape. And after learning this stuff, it was so much easier to dress myself. So comment below if you have an hourglass body shape or if you have any other notable celebrities with this body shape because I'm always looking for dressing inspiration. And don't forget to like this video so that it can reach other people who are interested in learning about what I preach. Most importantly, don't forget to subscribe and become part of the Level Up family and um, be, just be part of a place where we're on the journey to level up our wardrobes, ourself and our lifestyle and be the best version of us that we can be because life is too short and you just have to give it 100%. I will see you guys in my next video. Stay safe, stay smart and have a beautiful day wherever you are. Take care guys. Bye.